Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, The Cycling Frog, and today another podcast, The Cycling Frogcast. Uh, of course we're gonna discuss the latest Ronde van Vlaanderen, what an insane race it was. It was history making by Pogacar and we saw a very strong performance from Van der Poel also, but Pogacar was clearly, clearly, clearly the best and it's only the third rider in history to win a Tour de France in the Ronde van Vlaanderen, so we were watching history. Uh, one of the facets Ronde van Vlaanderen also. Uh, some minor disappointments like Pitcock, Van Aert and the whole team. Uh, we only saw Laporte and Van Hooydonk, while we were more expecting also from Tischbenot. Uh, we saw an insha- insane cra- crash by Filip Majuzic. Um, he has been taken out of the race, very good decision. Um, some nasty, that was a very nasty crash. Uh, Tim Wellens broke uh, something on four places. And uh, yeah, that that was very dirty. Also, White Van Aert was in that crash. I don't want to call it an excuse for not winning, but... Uh, it surely, it's surely not superb to fall in the Ronde van Vlaanderen. Um, what did we see more? We saw a very strange tactic of Team DSM. Uh, they tried to recreate the um, tactic of uh, Trixie Gaffrede and Dwarz of Vlaanderen. Uh, for me, it's I find it a bit silly. It's surely if you are Team DSM and you have maybe a top favorite. It's it makes more sense, but now you do this for a 19th place for a Degenkolb. Nah, uh, that, that doesn't feel right. Uh, it's already one of the most stressful races of the year on the Belgian roads, Cobble Hills. Uh, very narrow, um, quite dangerous. And if we, if teams going to do some tactics like that, cause more stress. I think it's it's some bad, bad, bad decision to do that. Um, also, uh, this week the Ronde. Wait, I need to say it in the proper way. It's Tulia Basque, the the tour of Basque land. Um, started today. Uh, I just saw the finish of the first stage. Ethan Hater wins. Uh, his first World Tour race of the year. Uh, some big uh, GC riders: uh, Mas, Vingegaard, Landa, Uran, Carapaz, Yates. So very interesting to see who is going to win there. And also, of course, in the weekend, Sunday we have Paris-Roubaix on Fer de Nord. Uh, but on that race, I will uh, make another podcast before uh, so Friday keep tuned then I'm going to discuss the Paris Roubaix of 2023 also make a trailer like I made for uh, the Ronde van Vlaanderen a scene that was very well liked uh, people enjoyed watching those uh, it's how it's also one of my biggest video is of course the Remco Evenepoel uh, compilation so I tried to make those more uh, but yeah it's for me to find a bit of balance between uh, the, f- the podcast which I really enjoy making I also enjoy making those compilations but it's um, I have to, um, it's not the same thing uh, I like to express my opinion about the races more than make those compilations but the people clearly like to see those compilations more so I gladly keep making them keep making them and uh, do you like the podcast please like and subscribe do you like the compilations also subscribe and um, keep my channel in the eye and you will see a lot more of me in the future 
थैंक यू गुड बाय